हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक दिस क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम गेट 2016 एग्जाम इट्स फॉर टू मार्क्स सो लेट्स जस्ट हैव अ लुक एट द स्टेटमेंट देन वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व इट वेन टू एट बिट नंबर्स ए सेवन टू ए नॉट एंड बी सेवन टू बी नॉट इन टू कॉम्प्लीमेंट रिप्रेजेंटेशन विद ए नॉट एंड बी नॉट एज द लीस्ट सिग्निफिकेंट बिट्स आर एडेड यूजिंग द रिपल कैरी एडर द सम बिट्स ऑप्टेन्ड आर एस सेवन टू एस नॉट and the carry bits are c7 to c0 an overflow is said to have occurred if okay so you can see we need to determine under which of the following conditions will there be a overflow okay now you know that if we add two positive numbers and the result is negative we'll say there is overflow similarly if you add two negative numbers and the result is positive we will say there is a overflow so whenever the most significant bit of a number is 1 that number is negative okay that means if a7 is 1 b7 is 1 both of these numbers will be negative okay and if s7 that means the most significant bit of the sum is 0 this number will be positive okay so if this case occurs okay that means A seven is one, B seven is one, S seven is zero. You will say there is overflow because you are adding two negative numbers, and the result is a positive number. Okay. Similarly, if both of these are zero and this one is one, okay, that means two positives add to a negative. Okay, that is also overflow condition. Okay. You can see A seven, B seven, S seven bar. That means A seven is one, B seven is one, S seven is zero. Okay, so two negatives are added, and their sum is positive. So this one is condition of overflow. Or the other case is when A seven, B seven is zero. That means two positives are added, and the sum is negative. Okay. So in this case also there will be overflow. That means our answer is option C. You can have a look at these examples. even though they are mentioning that numbers are 8 bits still the examples are 4 bits only anyways most of the things are exactly same you can see when you try to add minus 1 and minus 8 the sum will be minus 9 okay but minus 9 cannot be represented in 4 bits you can see 1 1 0 that means two negatives add and give a positive number this is not possible that means there is surely a overflow and the actual sum cannot be represented in 4 bits we need 5 bits minimum okay so this is the actual sign bit similarly you can have a look at this example now your answer is option c but some of the students think that answer is option a okay this is actually incorrect a can never be your answer because in case of signed numbers you can get a overflow without having the carry out as one okay so i can show you one example see in this case there is a overflow even if the carry out is zero the final carry of this entire addition is c7 or the carry out in this case the final carry of this addition is zero still there is a overflow okay and i have one more example in this case the final carry is one that means you have a carry out of this entire addition but still there is no overflow see negative and negative give you negative so this is valid there is no overflow the answer is four bits only okay so option a is incorrect now if you want to know more about these numbers and you want to understand this question in more detail you can search Gate two thousand and six question. It begins with we consider the addition something. Okay, so you can search gate two thousand and six. We consider on YouTube, and you can find my video, or I'll just link it in the description or pin the top comment. Okay.